Hi, I'm Joey Slevoff for HomeCountyTicket.com. I am here with the uh, state qualifier in the 3200, Coley Gordon. How's it going, Coley? Pretty good, how are you? Cannot complain. Cannot complain. Well, I have some questions for you. First one we have, you have been chasing the All Ohio Dream for four years. How does it feel to finally get it done? Um, it was really a great accomplishment. I was really surprised I actually got it because going into the season, um, I never planned to make it to state at all, let alone get all Ohio. I always planned on getting it in cross country. And then coming in this, as the season progressed, we, the goal got more and more achievable and it was really cool to finally get there. It's nice to hear and um, good job. High five. Thanks, Joe. What were your nerves like heading into state finals knowing it would be your last official high school race? Um, I was extremely nervous, more nervous than I've ever been before. Um, I had to take a walk and just think about things and relax before the race for a while. You didn't, take, I, you didn't take a run? I did take a run too, <laughs> but you know. And coach tried to talk me down and it didn't help too much. I was calm pretty nervous. Calm your nerves, but yeah. I mean, sometimes nervousness helps, though, in, in, in some cases. Yes. I'm not sure about yours. It does, because it builds up adrenaline and energy. As you get Just like right now. As soon as the race went, I was all right. Though. You're in the zone. Mm -hmm. Okay, what do you listen to, or what do you do before a race to get yourself pumped or, like, I don't know, not nervous? Um, I don't listen to music like a lot of people. Well, I do, like, a couple hours before, but as the race approaches, I just do my normal warm-up and... Usually I just think through the race, play it out in my mind, and stuff like that. And that usually calms me down. Mm -hmm. Well, distant, distant, distance running, <clears throat> it isn't easy. What got you interested in running in the first place? Well, um, the reason I started uh, distance running is in Park District Track, there were only ever one or two people that ran the mile in the meets. And so I figured if I ran that, I would definitely get a ribbon or a medal. Get in the top five if there's only three people. Yep. Exactly. Good job. Well, you went sub 10 minutes and broke Scott Miller's record from 1983 in the 3200. What was it like to break a 30 year old record which had stood for so long? Um, it was really cool. Um, it had been my coach's goal all season long. and Was it your goal too? It became my goal yeah. after a while. I didn't know. <laughs> I thought his goals were a little unachievable at the very beginning. That's what, that's what mo most coaches' goals are, mm -hmm. just a little above yours. But then as the season progressed, he, or I got closer and closer, and it was really cool to finally break it at uh, Nail it on the head. Hey, Bradley. That does it for us here at homescountyticket.com. Thanks for coming in, Cully. Thanks for having me, Joe. Anytime. It was a pleasure. It truly was. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm Joey Schlegelbach from homescountyticket.com. Thanks for joining us.